was a finger originally a r word or what what have you i will also say that if the son had mental issues the judge would not allow him to enter into a plea because that would be a competency issue and everything would go away okay thank you so much baby girl um, I, hey um i just wanted to say yes, that it, it, it also um uh, triggered me because I am a victim myself and mm -hmm. my baby sister was uh, going to be three when she was a victim and um, they it's a lie uh, how he first said that um, a two year old can't tell what happened that's not true they have dolls that have uh, female um, parts on it and males and they sit there and they let the, they give the, the, the dolls to the, the, the child and they let the child express and and what and they take their notes and they have ways of talking and communicating with them so that's not true but that also triggers me i just wanted to say that that's not true they can get it out of a child that's that young thank you thank you for your yeah. input welcome to the back to the table kk what's popping so i want to know why he's cherry picking his probation uh his probation uh orders he's saying that he can't talk about the case hell even jurors can talk about the case after it's finished um, he can't talk about the case, but yet still, uh, a condition is that he cannot be around those children, but he still is. So why, why is that? Well, we really, okay, so allegedly, allegedly, we don't know if he can and cannot be around. Um, why, why are you posting no, that in my it. comments? That's, Kick lovely, lovely. Why are you doing that? That's in the paperwork that he cannot be around children. Like, who does that? You just was on here. Anyway, what they do? Oh, he can't be around any child under the age of 16. I don't know. But if anybody wants to know or, or needs any um, information to this case, you can go to Cal, um, Superior Court Clerk com. click on search records, and then you can see what um, you can find out any additional information that you need. Um, we have all of his paperwork. If you guys are tuned in, Mondays, Wednesdays, and Saturdays, the Beagle Storyline Investigation Season 2. Yes, we will be recapping it. We will be recapping it. But right now, we are recapping the Dre and Trina interview. That is what we're re recapping. Uh, welcome to the table, Yummy. Oh, you wasn't in here. I'm sorry. All right. Well, let me say one more thing and I'm going to get out. Can I say one more thing and I'm going to get out? Uh, Trina okay. B, since you're listening, uh, sis, where is this uh, lawsuit at? And, and where's this gag order that you mentioned last night? Mm -hmm. The lies. Okay. Hey, Lady B. I don't know hey, if you remember baby. me, but I had just I had changed my name, this Jada. But listen, mm -hmm. I wanted to speak on a co-defendant thing because I'm a court clerk now. I don't know everything, and I only been a court clerk for three and a half years. But okay. it's not a report that I can go to where though I can't see the co-defendant name. He said in the Dre Baby Live something about, oh, the co-defendant name is not in a report. Right. It's not in anything. I I do dispositions daily, daily. And it's not no case. Even with a child, it'll say probably the initials or it won't have the child name. But anything that's public record, you can see who was charged with it. So I it don't know no about that gag order and that co-defendant not being listed. Yeah, like that didn't make sense to me. But that's all I wanted to say. And you did your big one. Thank you, babe. Well, his son did. His son did. He did a big one. Thank you. I'll just wait until the video come out, lady. All right, Lily. Okay. So if you guys need any additional um, information, there is no co-defendant. We do know that, that that is a fact. So I don't understand how, you know, Trina is around his peers and still choose 
to tell a lie. You understand what I'm saying? So I don't understand what was the whole, like, the more and more he speaks, the more and more he keeps putting himself in situations that he need not to be in, okay? Yes, he is. And not only did he lie in front of 6K people or 7K people, he lied to his own supporters, which all he had to say was, listen, it's none of your business. If it, whatever um, someone pulls up on me, I can answer or not answer to. You know what I'm saying? I really don't give a shit. You know what I'm saying? So I could tell you it ain't none of your fucking business and going on about life. All you had to do was say it's none of your business. But instead, he chose to lie. But he got mad at Pastor saying he lied. No, he got upset with Pastor because Pastor didn't want to share who the fuck he fucked. Oh, they go pee right there. Hey, P. Hey, boo, hey. Trina B said last night his lawyer called him. We was on his live. It was like 2 in the morning. He said his lawyer called and told him he got to be in Atlanta by today or Monday to go in front of a judge for all the stuff that's going on on the internet. I don't know how true that is. He got okay, off live. Okay, so we got to look that up. He said he got to go to court because a judge, uh, his lawyer reached out to a, a judge reached out to his lawyer and told him that he got to come down there and talk about the stuff that's going on on social media. And he had nothing to do with the case at all. So we know he's deflecting. You know, goddamn well, a lawyer ain't call you at two o'clock and say you got to be in Atlanta tomorrow or Monday. So we'll wait on that. We see. Yeah, we're going to wait on that. And what judge is going to call and say, listen, we need him in there. Like what? 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 Come on now. Make it make sense, people. Make it make oh, yeah, sense. we forgot about that one. It was it was one forty six a.m. Sure enough, he did say, yeah, my lawyer just called. I got to be at court. But this is one of the reasons he said why. He said because too many people were requesting discovery, which doesn't make sense. But uh, he said too many people was requesting discovery or information on the case. So he had to show up to court for public information now. The lawyer will call you because people request the public information. Make it make sense. Let me tell you something. Even in a community where it's residential or work, you have to know if there's a predator, a sexual predator. It is as me as a citizen of the United States of this America. That is my born right. They put you on a sex registry, which we're getting ready to look up, and we have facts on. You see what I'm saying? You know, y'all got to know who to fuck with. Go ahead, diary. Hey, beautiful lady. Um, hey, I baby. just wanted to say that. A couple of days, Trina was telling um, Andre, a.k.a. Low Dash, um, that he was coming back to Atlanta to visit her so they could turn up again because they had so much fun. Now, all of a sudden, he's saying that this lawyer, whoever called him at 2 to 3 o'clock in the morning, uh-uh, the math ain't mathing, sir. <laughs> you know, he's trying to play it off. No, you, you're not going to a court. You're going down there to smoke more crack with low. Get it real. Ooh. Okay. And hi, Lady B. Um, I wanted to say that uh, I heard someone say something about uh, Trina B is representing the black male and the black race. No, Trina B is in the LGBTQ. This does elemental P-R-R-Y-Z-Q-R-S. He's in that community. He has nothing to do with the black man and the black race. One minute he's uh, giving interviews to talking about the KKK. So we remember everything that Trina B has said. You will never get away with none of this, Trina B. You talked about you wish the KKK did, KKK did something. We heard you. We no, heard he you. Said Guan he said he wanted Lee Ebony to be hung by the KKK. Okay, and yes. rape. That's what he yes. said. And, and, and she's sitting up here being his cheerleader. Defending him. Yes. The same one that came in my room so graciously I'll under a fufu page and threatened me. Okay? Yes, DEA, how are you? How you doing, Miss B? I just want to know something. Mm -hmm. So he said that, that the okay. lady, um, he, the girl went to the. Uh, Okay. 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 So, what would what would make her all of a sudden pop out and say some shit about a sexual assault on her 
if she got in trouble for something that happened in school, what would make her just think of that? We would never know. We would never, ever know because you he's not going to come that, up. That, that situation happened like that? I no. need all facts and no. From what I just heard, yeah, absolutely man. not. That don't even sound mm-hmm. right. No, it doesn't. If a person right. gets in trouble at school and, 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 and the age group that she in, I don't mm-hmm. see that popping up in her head just like that. And then after she said it, she had to talk to her employees and all that. I don't think that she did all that. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And you know, hey, Lady B, hey, everybody. Hey, babe. <clears throat> Something I wanted to point out and what Trina wants us to hope we don't see. Um, So, you know, I was on the phone, but um, I thought I heard somebody. I could have sworn I heard somebody say that Trina just said uh, they got to go to go down there to the court because they calling them in and all that. Mm -hmm. Like it's some special call in. Am -hmm. I right? Yep, that's what he said. Well, you called him that time of morning, Tommy. He said the FBI called him. As long as I've been alive, I ain't never known the FBI to call you. I ain't never known ever. the IRS to call you. They come to the IRS will send a letter. FBI comes to your door. They don't call you. No lawyers calling you at 2 a.m., 3 a.m. in the morning. And for the lady who got up here with the LGBT thing, let me please explain something to you. One gay person does not represent an entire community of people, just like this young man who did this offense or his father does not represent the entire black community. This is not an LGBT issue. This is a criminal issue and a violation against the child issue. This is not a gay issue. We're not going to start the gay people against straight people thing. This type of things divides us, and then we can't move forward to do what we need to do as a community. I am a part of the black community. I'm a woman before anything, and I'm black before anything. But we can be black and gay. We are still one community and one people. Sorry, Tommy. No, that's okay. Trina just trying to... um... I don't know why he just not just facing the shit. He could have turned this into... Um, story time and, and just let it be you know right. just tell the truth and let it go you know and I don't know what the point of the son coming I mean he's tired of people talking about him and he might not have done this Tommy so he needs to tell the come on and give his story if he's been coached to that degree he might not have done this what if he didn't do this and you hearing people say this about you and you yes. took this shit, but you really didn't do this? Well, he needs to come on and tell it. He needs to just come on, put it to rest, tell it. Um, he ain't told it all. He has not. Okay. His daddy, his daddy is like forcing him not to talk. And that's not right. Let him tell it. Let I him tell it. I want y'all to listen to this. I don't know who guys was on this. Right here, um, Gigi and Messy Boots. I'll be right with you, I promise. But I just kind of wanted to just play just a little bit this part of the video. He's doing 30 years, and um, your son is doing the probation time for it for what he did, which was child cruelty. What is child cruelty and the law? Uh, what does that mean? Does it mean like what I mean, Georgia? Look it up. Okay, wait a minute, y'all. So I wanted y'all to listen to this, right? So he pled to the lesser charge, just like Pete just came up here to say, a murderer who um, who did something can plead to, what is it, Mal, uh, what is it, what is he says? Um, 
I forgot the goddamn word. All right, GG. Wait, what is it? Malpractice? What? Not malpractice. What is it called? Manslaughter. Right, y'all. Y'all, y'all help me out here. I'm freaking doing fifty million things. Manslaughter. Manslaughter. Mm-hmm. GG. Welcome to the table, baby. Welcome to the table, Tommy. I want to say I apologize before you get in. I apologize for everything that happened to you and your babies. I do not. I do not come in agreement with that. I think that that is the worst thing that anybody can do is attack people's children. Attack people's Absolutely. children. I'm sorry, you got to go through that. this. And I just wanted to say that mother to mother, woman to woman, that is so inappropriate. You know what I'm saying? And this is why my foot is on this mat. We don't do yes. stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? It's wrong. We don't play with people's kids. Go ahead, Gigi. I appreciate it. You are. How are y'all doing? I've been, uh, I've been by with you all morning, Lady B. Yeah. <laughs> so I was just wondering if you could just replay, because it looks like you got like over a thousand more people in. Just play when he came in your room and what was said okay. for the people that's just now coming in. All right. Thank okay. you. Y'all can run me up to this. Could y'all run me up so I can play this up? All right, Gigi. I'll go do it. Hey, Nikki. Welcome to the table, hey, babe. Baby. Could y'all run me up, please, hey. so we can get... Yes. I just want to say, <clears throat> if you know... Thank you, baby. I'm one of the messages to y'all as well, because on your account, on your live, he said, ain't no two-year-old. Two-year-old can't tell. How you know a two-year-old can't tell? My two-year-old needs to talk. And so can my nephew. He was just so adamant and so willingly, freely to say a two-year-old can't tell, like, he know that for a fact because the two-year-old didn't tell on him. I just right. didn't like the way he said that. I just wanted to hint on that. Okay, we're getting ready to play the video now. We're getting ready to replay. For those who are not in here, please share the live. Please be so kind. This man got seven boxes for a lie. And here we are. We got somewhat of the truth. And um, this wasn't for a bean. I never asked for one coin. Before she came up in here, at telling talking about she going um we gotta make this worth it, you know what I'm saying? We gotta we got we gotta make this worth it. This woman came up in here um under a fake page, become a paid host with full of tenacity. Inbox him right now if you want to become a part of a host just like me. We became number seventeen in the first draft of uh of Beagle's top uh, agencies. We came in number seventeen. Become a paid host with full of tenacity, please. And also, you know, I can't shout my girl out, but y'all know who my girl is. All right, y'all. Here we go. Um, please, please, everyone, just please be so kind. Thank you. Here we go. <laughs> my bad. I said number one. I got so excited. All right. My bad. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes I get overjoyed. All right. You know what I'm saying? Oh, go ahead and talk. I'm sorry. Go ahead, baby. Why do y'all listen to a man? who constantly makes up lies each and every and every day about everybody that's on live. Everybody. Right. I agree. The I agree. The question that's is... That's a wonderful question. This, this, the question is, is, is this. How, and, and this is Cobb County. Everybody knows Cobb County. How can somebody get go from aggravated charges to cruelty to children if they were convicted of Aggravated charges. That's, that's, that's what we're trying to find out. That's why okay. he found that's, dumb. So if, I'm, if I'm on the cruelty to children charge, that means obviously I didn't do what was said that was done at first. Right. So why did they charge you with cruelty to children? How did they get because to? The, how did they the, get to the point? Okay. So could you just walk me through it, Brian? How did they get to the point? How did this all happen? How did they, How did you even get into this mess? Um, I was at work or whatever. I, I can't, I'm not going to really explain because I'm not allowed to really explain what happened with the case. Okay. Not me talking to y'all right now is really a violation of my probation. Okay. So what y'all think about this? If you guys want to hear more, we got to run me up. I'm not even on box two. Let's go. Come on now. Um, let's go. Seven boxes to a lie. He lied and he lied not only to, uh, he hates for me to ask. Thank you, Sarah. I know. I know, sugar. Um, he lied to his people. That's what he did wrong. When he could have just simply said, you know what, this is what happened. I encourage people who haven't been caught up in this situation. He, Girl, get the fuck out of here because you probably the bitch that's getting ready to go down. Yeah, that's what you about to do. You you, you, you the bitch that's about to go down. We just going to slow walk this shit. Anyway, 
like why he can't talk since he played out. This is what we're trying to figure out. But unfortunately, when he got up here, his phone just kept ringing. His phone just kept ringing. His phone kept ringing. Okay? His phone just kept ringing. So um, we're going to press play. Thank you guys for the gift. Okay. Well, we don't want you to violate it, but I, I, I want to know, what was the age of the door? What was the age of the kid? Like, what was, yeah. But what you it was never the Hello, I Ms. just wanted Cancel. to say Wait, one let thing. Let me just say your name. Cancel. Cancel. Let me just say your name. Welcome, Cancel Potato Head. Welcome, girl. Welcome. Y'all had to be my other, my hey, other you But look, right, the reason why he stated that sex offenders, once they're prosecuted, that is a violation of their probation or parole of being on social media. That's why he said that. They're not supposed to be online on social media, Facebook, mm. anything where they can have interaction with children or anything. That's a violation. That's all I had to say. Oh my God. Okay, we four shields. We four shields away to my second box, everybody. You either work or whatever, but if you at work, you at work, period. Exactly. I'm at work. You know what? He hates that I ask people. The rock. We gotta get gifts from other people now. You know what I'm saying? We gotta get gifts, okay? We gotta get other people gifted, okay? Because we gotta let them know this ain't us begging. You know what I'm saying? We gotta let them know that part. You know what I'm saying? That part. Every time I ask, he saying, "Cause for real." It, it was never. It, it, it was they never. They trying to act like old. we broke over here. I don't know where y'all A two-year-old can't tell. First right. life, anyway. So how was it gonna be a two-year-old? Right. Was it a, was now we're gonna repeat that, y'all. He said, "How was it going?" Was actually, younger than what she was. Okay. Yep. Aggravated charges for cruelty to children. If they're convicted of aggravated charges, that, that, that's, that's what I'm trying to find out. That's why he's kind of dumb. Pure support. Uh, if I'm on a cruelty to children charge, that means obviously I didn't do what was said that was done at first. Right. So why did they charge you? with cruelty to children. How did they get to how did they get to the point okay, so could you just walk me through it, Brian, how did they get to the point? How did this all happen? How did they, how did you even get into this mess? Um, I was at work or whatever. I, I can't I'm not gonna really explain because 'cause I'm not allowed to really explain what happened with the case. Okay. Uh, me talking to y'all right now is really a violation of my probation. Okay. Well, we don't want you to violate it, but I, I, I want to know what was the age of the door? What was the age of the kid? Like, what was, yeah. But whatever you do, it, no, it, it was never, it, it was never no two year old. I don't mm. know where y'all got that. A two year old can't tell. First right. Life anyway. So, how was it going to be a two year old? Right. Was it a was it a girl who lied and said she was eighteen years of age and she was actually younger than what she was? It was never none of that. It was a situation where a little girl got in trouble at school for something that she did. That she okay. was not supposed to. And with another student. And another student went and said that her parent was doing something. Not to that. Interview. I mean, uh, her parent was saying that she she that well, the girl was saying that something was done to her. The other girl that she was doing, that, that, that she got in trouble with. Okay. Mm -hmm. So he's saying that there was two people that was in, um, yeah, he's scared he's going to say something about the other case. There was two young ladies that he said, the young lady, both of them got in trouble. So they told that he touched them to get out of trouble. This is what Brian Jr. just said. That is the report. That is the conclusion. Everything else is Trina B. calling. Charlie said the police report says girl told counselor. Yes, we have the original police report, but right now we're going by what the son says. I need y'all to follow me. I know y'all don't understand because I'm very new to b -Go, but I need you, I need y'all to get with my interviewing tactics or my interviewing techniques. I know y'all don't quite understand it. You know what I'm saying? At that point in time, when I interview, it doesn't matter what I think. My, I'm just trying to get the facts. It doesn't matter what I think. It doesn't matter what my opinion is. It doesn't matter. We're just trying to get the straight facts. That is how I interview. That is how I interview. Um, it's the fact that he says a little girl, but the person was in the house with him and his girlfriend. Right. So all of it, it just doesn't sound right. So Brian, again, you are more than welcome to come up here. 
Um, so basically, whatever the child did to another one, the parents assumed the kids were such. Basically, that's what he's saying. They asked where the child learned it from, and that child said it was Brian who did it to him. Right. That is what's going on. Oh, the little girl probably was doing something inappropriate with the child and told. Exactly. Okay, so and probably he probably seen his mother and his father having sex, and she probably went to school and probably did it and did the demonstration, and they probably was like, where you learned this from? And they probably said, the son. Okay, y'all? So let's listen to the facts here. It was another two girls that was involved. Okay, let's listen to what he's not saying. All right? Only someone that has tried a two-year-old, right, and then what the girl was not to. And that don't make sense because that's not cruelty. Well, listen, look. Lady B, did I hear you correctly? Did you just say that maybe he saw the mom and the the little girl saw the mom and I'm only going by what the people are saying here. Oh, okay. 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 You know? Dang. They was about to cut my head off. I know, goddamn. I told y'all my stance two days ago. It ain't gonna change. You know what I'm saying? I said what I said two days ago. So the kids was at school doing something strange, and we don't know that. This is what he's leading the story to be. Something was being done to her. And because she got in trouble, she didn't know what to say. So she just put it on somebody. She had to get herself out of trouble. So that's what happened. So now y'all understand what he's saying? Do y'all understand what he said? Not what Lady B said. Because see, you people that listen to this shit and say Lady B has said. You know what I'm saying? Lady B ain't say shit. Right. You know what I'm saying, Sinika? Like, yep, Lady B ain't say shit. Tell me what the people said. We're going to rewind it. We're going to rewind it. Run me up. We almost did to the second box. All right? So don't y'all be putting, say, Lady B said shit. Okay? I will rewind. But, Bunny, can you please gift me? Can you please become a Lady B supporter? Okay? The first signs of speech impediment, urination, and proper touch with peers. Okay. One child told the other child what they was doing, and the child got into it, and another child told you know, this is what Brian says is going on, where he indirectly said what was going on. It did not come out of my mouth. It did not come out of your mouth. This came out of Brian Jr.'s mouth. Let's not take words and twist it. This is not the, old, the other um, um, platform. This is Lady B. We, we are fair over here, right? We let people tell on themselves. This is what he's doing. Let's go. Let's get this, let's get this out before I have to call some people up. Because we got to get busy on some other shit in a minute. Okay. Okay. Trina B. Son, I will be giving it to the outlet so you guys can view it for yourself. And um, hopefully we'll get to my second box by 1 p.m. this afternoon before lunchtime. Next time you interview someone, let them talk. Who are you again? Bitch, in order for an interview to go down, I got to ask a fucking question, you nif not. The fuck? Who the fuck is it? Who is these people talking to? All right, he's about to come on and play. I'm trying to find out. That's why he sound dumb. All right, let's go back. Like, who the fuck is, like, hello? Tula Makano? You got to go. All right, let's go. Just disrespectful. All right. Go ahead and talk. I'm sorry. Go ahead, Why do y'all listen to a man? who constantly makes up lies each and every and every day about everybody that's on live. Everybody. Right. I agree. The question, I agree. The question that's is... That's a wonderful question. This, this, the question is, is, is this. How, and, and this is kind of, kind of 
County. Everybody knows Kyle County. How can somebody get go from aggravated charges to cruelty to children if they are convicted of aggravated charges? That's, that's, that's what we're trying to find out. That's why okay. you sound that's, dumb. So if, I'm, if I'm on a cruelty to children charge, that means obviously I didn't do what was said that was done at first. Right. So why did they charge you with cruelty to children? How did they get because to... How did they get to the point? Okay, so could you just walk me through it, Brian? How did they get to the point? How did this all happen? How did they, how did you even get into this mess? Um, I was at work or whatever. I, I can't. I'm not going to really explain because I'm not allowed to really explain what happened with the case. Okay. Now, me talking to y'all right now is really a violation of my probation. Okay. Well, we don't want you to violate it, but I, I, I want to know what was the age of the do what was the age of the kid, like what was, yeah, but well, whatever you. It was to never no, it, it was never it, it was never no two year old. I don't mm -hmm. know where y'all got that. A two year old can't tell. First right. time anyway. So how was it going to be a two year old? Right. Was it a was it a girl who lied and said she was eighteen years of age and she was actually younger than what she was? It was never none of that. It was a situation where a little girl got in trouble at school for something that she did. That she okay. was not supposed to. And with another student. And another student went and said that her parent was doing something not to them. Interview. I mean, uh -huh. Her parent was saying that she, she that well, the girl was saying that she, something was done to her, the other girl that she was doing, that, that, that she got in trouble with. Mm hmm said that she was that something was being done to her and because she got in trouble she didn't know what to say so she just put it on somebody she had to get herself out of trouble so that's what happened and what we'll trina b son this is trina b son explaining what happened with his case this is trina b son calling right now Hi, sweetie. Go ahead. Yep, this is Trina B. Um. Is that your dad calling you? I'm sorry. So, okay, so the little girl went to school and said something. This right here, right? I cannot believe that people would gift a liar, a molester, a raper, a criminal, right? And someone is giving you an exclusive tea. You got your tea, your, your, your slippers off, you're smoking your cigarettes and shit, you're fucking drinking your little Coke, um, your Coke sodas and your Pepsis and shit. Can y'all run a sister up? Because Ebony made this about money, and we need to let her know. You pissed off? Okay. But why would the kid put it on him out of all people? I don't know. I don't know. Why did he plead guilty again? All right. If that is what he is, in fact, what he's alleging, that one kid did something to another kid, they got caught, they went into the counselor, they were asked, where did you learn this from? And the first person they came up with was Brian Jr., you understand what I'm saying? They came up with Brian Jr. Now, the second thing is, how in the hell? Hey, Lady B. Hey, baby. Hey. So, I've been, every day I've been trying to think about it, and I, and I looked up the cruelty or whatever, and so the thing that kept sticking out to me with cruelty of a child was the fact that it stated that, you know, um, that could be, whether it's mentally abused, physically abused, or whatever the case may be to a child, like, doesn't necessarily mean, you know, it was one thing in particular. So, I'm, 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 I'm like everybody else, I guess. I guess everybody trying to see, like, what was the reason why, okay, I'm trying to put myself in the baby girl's shoes. Go to school, you got a situation happen. They ask you a question. Okay, so they're not going to charge. I've seen many cases where girls have lied, um, and it's been dropped. There has been no extra charges. You see what I'm saying? So the fact that even if that rape wasn't a charge or whatever the case may have been, there's still a charge, you know, saying that you were cruel, you know, cruel. So maybe I'm thinking maybe the little girl spoke on something else that he has done to her. 
if that's the case, as to why he got the cruelty. Like, I don't know. I'm sorry. I, I guess I'm just confused, and no, I'm just trying to get a little that's help. What we're, that's what we're trying to say, say right now, is that we don't understand. Okay. So we wanted okay. the, 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 him to, the kid was performing the, the same act on the kid that he did to her. Okay. Without the, the, Right. You know what I'm saying? Not the cruelty was a bargain. Okay, the cruelty was a bargain. But because they wanted to find out was it true or not, they probably detained him. And You know what I'm saying? They probably detained him. I don't know. Maybe they were thinking that he was going to cop out or something. He just made a bargain because with the you know defense. When, and you know when there's a rape, they, like you said, they do a rape kit. Da, da, da. Okay, so with this situation, the girl's still saying, okay, he did. But at that point in time, they couldn't get no DNA from the little girl, you know, because it didn't it didn't happen like right then and there. You know what I'm saying? Like it didn't happen that day or probably the day before. So I'm thinking maybe that's why the charge was lessened because we can't we can't get you for rape because even if we do a rape kit, you didn't molest her today. You didn't molest her yesterday. So that DNA is not going to be on her. But because she's saying that, hey, he's the one that's been doing this to me. So now we got this child, you know what I'm saying, saying, OK, well, he did this to me. So we have have to charge you with something we got to do some type of investigation and so cruelty is you've been you know physically you could have been emotionally abusing her or mentally you've done something to make her feel like this is okay to do to someone else so i think that's what i'm kind of like getting from it or what you the same thing what you just said mm -hmm. i don't know i'm gonna drop down I feel like I keep going well, thank on you about it. thank you thank you so much tammy said but why lie if that was the case that's what we're trying to figure out why would you lie they asked her where she learned that from Trina. Um, she said Trina B's son. Right. So if she, did, did, did she see Trina B's son in act? What happened? In his story, he says something was strong enough to lock him up. Right. Okay. So you understand you have to have the, what the DA will always give you an option to plead deal for a lesser charge. Of course they will. Go ahead, um, Yummy. Um, I wanted to ask something. Do you remember when um Trina B went live and he said he was mad at the daughter in law for speaking with China and mm -hmm. he blurted out and said that's why your oldest daughter was being touched. Yeah, we got that. that. This is the same child? Oh, okay. Okay. We I'm got sorry. that. We no no no. Okay. That's what we trying to figure out. Was it this child? We didn't get that because they kept calling his phone, telling him to get the hell off the, um, get the hell off my life. You know what I'm saying? And of course, oh, the only thing that yeah. he's worrying about is trying to get people to stop lying on him because only he knows what's going on with the case. Now, if Trina would have just said, this is what happened in the case. My son got caught up. This is what he did in X, Y, and Z. This wouldn't even be a problem. You know what I'm we wouldn't even be here now. You know what I'm saying? But that's not what's the case. Kena, I'm um, um, yeah. Kena. Trina just kept lying. You know what I'm saying? He made him. He he made it seem like yeah, the kid made, made everything so up based stories. on the counselor, right? You know what I'm saying? Or Trina B made it seem like there yeah, was somebody doing time that. in jail for thirty fucking years, and that's also not true. Like why he just didn't come out? I think that he can win more people with honey than he can do with vinegar. You know what I'm saying? But right now I don't give a fuck because these motherfuckers is on a mission to cut off my head. I, two people came up in here threatening me, and I need all of their um, addresses, and I need everything at this point. So um, tap, share, and listen. Okay. Oh wow. Okay, I'm gonna drop down. Thank you, Yummy. Thanks for keeping us um, informed. Okay, so let's press play. Something. What's your name? Oh, you going to keep calling? Say double lock. That's it. All this shit right here that he doing is fucking for what? It could have been so simple. He touched that girl in the story. Oh, he's going to keep calling right. Tell him to block him real quick. Mm-hmm. Hello? 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 Y'all, I'm, I'm sorry. And I got my um, my agency up in here. So he's a witness to, as to everything that's going on. So we need to contact Bigo. Hello? 
Like what happened? Okay, we need the son and father's do um dob asap. We need that. We don't have the correct dob. We need the dob to Trina and to the son. We need the date of birth, the dob. Okay, we need that. Okay, we need that. Okay, so we got the son. Copy. Paste. All right, here we go. I think the son is born April 97, you know I mean? Uh huh. Yep, you're right. What's the father's? Nope. You have a 97, you're right, Capricorn. We need Trina's birthday. The correct one. Hey, hey, I am her. Hey, you're a. Hey, baby. So, um, Felicity Anthony, I will be forwarding you all information and all IV numbers that we need to repeat and to turn into Vigo. When 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 Vigo turn against you, don't cry. Vigo will turn against me. I'm almost sure of that. You know what I'm saying? And I won't cry. You don't think that I know that? You don't think that's the name of the game? I'm fully aware. That part. I mean, what you think that I, I go back in carriages with some of these people? These people don't know me. You know what I'm saying? You You don't think that? Exactly, Nikki, but my family won't. But my family won't. I sit with my family daily. You bitches are new. Okay? You bitches don't even fuck with me. Right. You know what I'm saying? And we're okay with that. When Bigo, I hope, I hope my, my, my aunt, when Bigo turns against you, but my family won't. I need that ID too. I hope y'all got that ID number too, because they, they. This is a. This is um someone that's able to change their ID numbers. That's zero 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 three two four. Somebody um screenshot that and send that to my um to my um to officially lady B R G. You know what I'm saying? When Beagle turns against me, my family gonna stand right here, hands down. And I know how to turn the fucking um, X button off and take my ass to bed. I don't gotta be on here. I choose to. Y'all got it. Thank you for the um. Thank you. Thank you everybody who sent it to me. Thank you. Yeah, we need that ID number. Thank you because I'm gonna show you how threats are to be not made. Okay. You don't think that um. I'm sure the little piece of evidence or whatever you come to fuck up with. Won't be drugging. There'll be 2,000 in the room screaming, fuck her, fuck her, fuck her. Calling me all types of fucking names. You can't call me a name that I haven't been called. I don't give a fuck. Let me see. We working on your file, Lady B. We about to get you. Okay, we got all of that. Thank you. Thank you, guys. I think I'm going to have to handle my BI. Thank you, everybody. Yeah, we got that, too. All right, who else was to come in here and threaten me? My lady B sits by herself and fucked me. Right, I'm sitting here by myself. Can I just take a moment to say this? How you going to get me? with truth or with lies. If it's the truth, it's the fucking truth. If it's a lie, it's a fucking lie. I don't need to fucking defend neither. And I don't. I don't give a fuck what you bitches find. The fact is, if you do find it and you do put my business out here, it's on and it's up and it's stuck. That's all I'm saying is do your big one. Thank you, Irish girl. And I love y'all down for that. But let's get back to the tape. Because you bitches don't scare me, okay? I keep telling y'all that. You know. Hey, 
Yeah, he's definitely trying to call him. Hey, you're going to have to block him real quick. I know you don't want to block him, but see? They called. All right, y'all. And um, mm, mm, mm. this is it. That was the end of the video, y'all. That was really the end of the video. Okay, it was seven minutes long, but the other two, he dropped down, and that was it. He never came back up after that. You know what I'm he never came back up. So we did get it recorded. It will be posted to the BTV. Um, it will.